Hey, welcome back. We wanted to show you a couple of things that we found in some of the boxes that we were going through. Um, this is all wood in here. It's beautiful. And just really, really interesting. They all have uh, lids and little canister things and stuff I'm like sure that. I'm sure that's some sort of special type of wood. Yeah, I don't that's know what wood. I'm going to ask Mark if he comes back. If he knows um, what kind of wood that is. Yeah. But One of our neighbors is, over here is a woodworker. And so that was just one of the cool things that we found in one of the units, uh, one of the boxes. All right, here's another one that again we went through some of this. We're not going to go. We're not going to open it all but, on camera. Uh, just but. to show you some of the stuff that we found in here. Oh, look at that! Is that not beautiful? Look it is. Right um, it's like a red, red clay or red mud. Yeah. Um, earthenware. It's. I don't know if you can see it in the film here, but it is a um, like kind of Chinese or some sort of Asian stamping on the bottoms. And that's what this but. whole box is right here. And Tracy already looked it up. Yeah, they're all little teapots and similar things. They're yeah. all super cool. About, uh, what did you say, $20? Um, yeah, I'm piece? looking like they may go for about $20 to $30 a piece on eBay. I'm actually probably one of us will take... The first couple, maybe start them in an auction at that price, just to make sure we're not undervaluing ourselves. Right, but this whole tub is full of nothing but that. So this is like, if the, those are 20 to $30 a piece, we're talking about a 500 to a thousand dollar tub. Yep. Just right here, okay? Yep. So this is one of the good things that we get in units. Yes. Okay? And, and the rest of these are mystery tubs we so not, yeah. yeah we haven't looked through these yet so these are going to be more of the mystery tubs but we wanted to show you some of the cool stuff that we do find when we're going through things on our own all right here we go all right and i actually don't know 100 percent what units these tubs came from so i'm yeah. thinking they may you don't have to hold your phone either oh yeah i don't right. i'm back on my um camera where I can wear it on my head and I have my hands oh, free. Look at this. It's one of the posters. We do. Oh, here. that is super cool. Yep. Which that makes me think that this tub here may be from the antique unit because he had a thing for um anime and he did have a thing for bullets. So yeah. Yep. This definitely would be a tub from the antique unit. Yep. But it's uh very cool stuff so far this is a knife sharpener an electric knife sharpener chef's choice yeah we don't uh, really look those up but we can definitely look it up oh That's here we go a pump <laughs> which Didn't i think i think we said that yesterday? yesterday that we find on average i would say maybe two per unit would okay, you say that's about... an electric one too so i'll actually probably keep that in it if it doesn't have the value i'm going to stick it in our unit yes that we're going to sell Right here, we've got some vinyl wall covering. I'll probably look that up and probably wind up selling that on eBay. eBay or Amazon? Yeah. Yeah, this would be a great candidate for Amazon because of it being uh, heavy. Ooh. Oh, man, we've got a cool porcelain item here, but it seems to be missing a head. Maybe it was supposed to be that way? I don't think so. But it could. It, it could not. <laughs> Oh, that would be perfect. It's a headless uh, person. It is a headless person, and I found the head. Oh, she, he had them wrapped separately. Yep. So. We might could repair that and stick it in the booth. I mean, it's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. Well, we'll think about that. Okay, $14 for it in two pieces. Mm, I hear something broken in there. At least I hear something. What do we got? I don't know. It's in two pieces there. It's in multiple pieces. It's a glass deer. deer. It was a blown glass deer that he paid $13 for and it is broken. Okay, let's see if we can... That looks like it fits like that on here. Yeah, that, so. it, it does have broken grass as well. The grass is in here. I don't know about that one. I'm not, not feeling too confident on that one. Yeah, I'm going to just go ahead and give it to Goodwill. Yeah. I'm not really, I'm not worried about it. Oh, well, that's sad. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 
Hopefully we have some things in here that aren't broken, but this... Oh, Lord. Oh. Oh. No, it's not. I don't know what this is. Wow. These are like... They're Hindu. These. This isn't glass. This is some kind of plastic or... What's that plastic that you always... Bakelite. Yeah, Bakelite. Is that Bakelite? I don't know. I would have to test it for Bakelite. I really don't know. Okay, well, that is just super cool. That looks uh, 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 Asian, too. Mm-hmm. That's glass or shell. Okay. And we have a little... Like a soap, soap dish. dish. Andrea by Sadat, made in Japan. Hmm. We can look it up. Yum. I like ones that we can look up. Ones we can't look up, I don't know what to do with those. Yeah, I got a figure. No, I got a glass. Oh, wow. That's actually pretty. Yeah. This he, goes he, with the soap dish, which it says it's a porcelain sauce and dish. Oh, okay. So well, that would be cool. We can put that one together. He paid seven. No, he was trying to sell it for seven fifty. Right. So probably not a lot of value. That's mm. what that tells us. Yeah. Because he actually knew his stuff. Yes, he did. Okay, that's probably going to end up going to Goodwill. And that was pretty. Yeah, that was that. That right there. So oh. we got some pretty good stuff in there. Except we got those broken. And we have a um, oil changing drainer. Oh, uh, we got Jack. We've got Fat Jack. This is Jack. This is our. This if I just is... pull that eye out right there, or that eye right there, this well, would don't be. Pull out the I'm eye. not going to pull it out. I'll pull out the eye, but that is what our Jack looks like. She is a fat little tubby tub. I'm just looking at the brand. Nothing fancy schmancy. Nothing fancy schmancy. And I'm there's that. That's a out. soldering gun. Okay, well I'm just going to move the, this off. I the table. tend to think that that's what it is, and that is what it is. It's a pretty heavy soldering gun. Okay, well this, no matter what, we're going to keep it. Okay. Because that is Jack's treasures. That is Jack. Jack is a treasure. Jack, Jack, Jack. Jack. That bunny cat. You know, okay. that, that might... I don't know. Okay, <sighs> well go ahead and stop the video so we can okay. clean this off the table. Okay, we just cleared everything off uh, so that you guys don't have to see us doing all of that. All right. Mm. Maybe. We look for the clicky keyboards, uh, keyboards that have a click to them. People like to buy them. I don't know why. I don't but either. But this is definitely an older one. Uh, you which, can tell by that. This one is definitely a no okay. on that one. Here you go. Here's a video. Ooh. Computer. Okay. Look into that. And I have a lot of, uh, of which we call it too. Oh, uh, that goes cords. with that. That's yeah, the this scanner. Is a scanner. That's going to go into the next unit. All right, we got some, some ink. ink cartridges. One of them is missing, but I will check those got out. Got a couple of sealed items here, an access point and a router. Those we will scan for Amazon for sure. Oh, gosh, yeah. Matter of fact, I think I got two of those up, the exact same ones. Sweet. Uh, this is a hard drive uh, adapter. Is that new also? Yeah. Sweet. Inside there. Okay. Uh, that's new. But we can't tell that one is new. But we could still do it as light new or yeah. very good yeah. is actually what I would do. Uh, this is an external drive, a floppy drive. Right mm -hmm. there. That one, I don't know anything about that one. This one might be the... Uh, that would be great. Let's see. No, it's not. Okay. But I have so many connections to those. I'll be able to do that. Uh, ooh. HDTV connection kit, your all-in-one AV cable solution. Nice. Okay, hopefully that's got some value to it. The problem is it doesn't have a barcode, so I can't scan it. But a lot of stuff here we get to scan for Amazon. And I mean, you look at these prices like this, $44.99, $59.99. And yes, those are old prices, but a lot of this stuff is obsolete. So and a lot of it they don't make anymore. It still has that kind of value to it oftentimes. It'll surprise you. Yeah, because they don't make it anymore. Mm -hmm. Because they don't make it, some people might have this. And they uh, want the exact want same it, one, believe it know. or not. Yeah, some people it's like weird. the older stuff, like AOL. All right, we'll be right back. Yep. Okay, we're back again. Here's a little one. Okay. 
That's a new one right self there. Self-stirring mug. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, you know what? We're going to self-stir you probably right on to the thing. I have no earthly idea what that is. Mm. Me either. This is for pitchers. Yeah. Okay, that's going to go somewhere else. A little wood box. Put that in the booth. Mm -hmm. This is the top for that. So now I can put that in the booth. This is a box Pick in a box. And, and it was like a display. Probably could hang like a necklace on it or something. This was just a plain I'm probably box. Probably nothing in that one. Giving either. that to Goodwill. Yeah. Oh, that's adorable. I love yeah. the wolf box. That'll go in the booth for That'll sure. That'll go into the booth. So I'm just going to put this stuff that's going to go back into the booth. In this here. I'll probably hang jewelry from and put in the booth and put a little price on that. That one I'm just going to put on Am in Amazon. Yep. Okay, I don't think you need to stop. Nah, no need. We got one place. more box that we're going to go through for you guys. Get my drink off of it. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed, but my big yes, we we gone. went we sold a big piece. We've sold several things today. Three things so far today on the marketplace. Uh, three or four. Yeah. I sold a brand new TV. The woman came to pick up a used TV, and I had a brand new one, and I sold her the brand new one for a hundred, as opposed to the used one for fifty. And then she picked up a little trinket that we just have sitting <laughs> up there and stuff like that because I just think they look cool. Okay. Oh, all right. Well, I'm already surprised. Okay, I do like that, but this one's going to be, I'm going to be a little gentle with it. Okay. Under Colors of uh, ben Benediction? U United Colors of Benetton? Yes. That was a popular brand in the 80s. Um, if it's in good shape, it would probably sell, but it seems kind of faded. Um, okay. Probably just kind of, I don't know. We'll take a look at it better. Okay. Mm. Mm. We got another clock right yeah, here. Yeah, we've definitely got clocks. Um, oh, please be something big. Me concert. Nope. Oh. Um, it's a beer shirt. Oh, well, this can be good. Not. It is made in USA. That's good. Mm -hmm. This is a clock. Um, it is made in the USA. It um. It's kind of falling apart. Yep, that'll probably go in the booth. That's we, what we I was thinking. For a couple dollars, and, you a, know, like five bucks or so, um, and then somebody will buy it. Yeah, there's a lady at our booth that loves to work on old clocks. Well, this is an old Nike. It's embroidered <sighs> right there. Made in USA. Are this, those are just stickers? Yeah, these are just stickers. Yeah. They're coming right off. I don't know. We'll take a look at, at that a little bit more. It's faded on the collar, but again, it's one of those things that, I mean, how many... Right. Embroidered. Right. Nike, the same color as the shirt. You know. Some old ribbons and things like that. Mm, I'm just curious about this because I saw the word Samsung. Empty box. Most of them are. Yeah, this one is too. This is just an old Knight's Bridge shirt. Some empty jewelry boxes. Okay, that is cool. That one is cool. Oh, celebrate the millennium. Oh, my plate. very favorite decorative plates. In celebration of the millennium, it is got a name on it. It's made in England. Yep. So. It's Spode. Spode. Eh, it's not the best brand. I, I would booth. it probably could. And you're having fun. <laughs> I like the ladybug much better than the plate. I can tell. I do like this right here. Okay, um, we gotta look on this one. It's it's wood. Are there any it's names or anything? Yeah. Um, it's part plastic here, which makes yeah. me think it's not that there old. There it is, right there. It's got it right there. I can't read um, it. Take a look. Genuine mahogany. Yeah. So this is mahogany. Use here. slot to adjust. Do not remove screws. I don't see a name on it. I'm about in the front. Right down there. A uh, Wittenauer barometer. So we'll have to do some research on that. My guess is that this will wind up in the booth for probably around $20, but obviously we'll do a little more research on that. But that's my, my first instinct. All right. Um, well, we have done a lot. Um, we're, we've got through a lot before we even did in video. Yes. We've had a lot of stuff picked up already. The TV got, uh, went, we sold the big dresser part. 
and I sold some kids weights that um, I never thought they were going to sell. And everything like that, we just put them up there, just really to put them up there because I didn't want to take them to the scrapyard. And so we sold those. Uh, I do have a couple more pieces that may or may not sell because a lot of people, what I've noticed is they'll tell me that they want it and they'll even say to me that I want it. And I said, well, just confirm a pickup time for me. And then I hear crickets. So <laughs> I've heard hearing that with a couple of the things and stuff like that. But this was what we found today. Uh, some really cool. Yeah, we're very uh, excited about the. the um... Summarize today. We got this wood right here, which is really cool. The um, uh, clay, clay stuff. Okay, we got all of these DVDs and everything like mm -hmm. that. Uh, a couple of shirts here. Some electronic stuff to going into Amazon. The shirts are going to Goodwill. Not the beer one. <laughs> Maybe not the beer one. I not haven't looked at it yet. A couple things for the booth. Okay. So uh, we did good today. Had another yes. really good day. Like I said, that's the prize of the day. Yeah, right definitely today. excited about the little uh, clay teapots and everything. Yeah, that and our lighting. Oh my gosh. Tracy even said she wanted another lighting. Yes. Because we found more stuff. That's we bought this one unit. Of them can literally go on Amazon. Probably. I don't know, a couple months before we started filming, we bought a lighting unit and it got kind of buried up and we've just started pulling the stuff out and listing it and selling it. And it's just been, it's been a lot of fun. Yeah, I sold $240 worth of light bulbs. Yeah, little tiny light bulbs. I mean, yes. they're barely bigger than Christmas tree bulbs yep. and it's just been fun. But anyhow, we will leave you for today yep. and we'll see you tomorrow we might yep. uh give you a peek inside a couple of units tomorrow but they're not they're not fun units they're not big units they're just the ones that we bought over at compass storage and we haven't emptied out yet so yeah i'm pretty sure he's getting mad at me because i haven't <laughs> but we're, we're gonna just, we're gonna so clear those everything. out tomorrow so we might give you a peek inside those tomorrow yeah but for now make sure you like subscribe share and we'll see you next time peace bye bye